I started working with PSTV when I started working at WHYY. We were told that the school district was revamping and restarting PSTV to have student-driven uh, cable channel in, at 440, uh, where students were gonna make content and be part of the production of PSTV studios. I was really excited and, and found out that we would be helping them add content in the early uh, years of as PSTV was growing. I contacted Shelly and told her, hey, fall 2016 is coming up, the election. What are you doing for elections with students? We were asked by the Democratic National Convention to do a student camp. Um, so with PSTV, I was able to get 25 students making content about the election and the issues that they saw they wanted uh, politicians to address. But Shelly wel welcomed us with open arms. Um, that was like the first time I really was able to fully teach in here. We did some studio production classes with them too over the first few years to help get some courses ready and start it. And we're about to start doing like a media teacher academy where we're gonna be having some professionals from the industry uh, talk to teachers, um, come to PSTV and the WHOI and provide them some equipment from the PSTV media hubs and trainings and stipends from WHOI to get the teachers excited to do media in their classroom, but also get content on PSTV. The idea of uh, partnering Penn students with school district students, high school students to make films together was a conversation that originally started with Tonya Wolford, Melanie Harris, Phil Nishinaga, and Shelley Wolf. And then we had to figure out how to do it. I would teach uh, Penn students filmmaking in the fall. And during the fall, the Penn students would visit different schools. And an open call would go out to uh, everybody in the district, inviting principals and teachers to apply to partner with us. And then, of course, there were the relationships with the principals and the teachers and the site coordinators. So there were a lot of people involved in creating the space where Penn students and high school students could come together. So I worked with PHTV on my filmmaking course, um, this partnership, for about nine years. And 60 films were produced by student partnerships, uh, high school and um, um, Penn student partnerships. The other thing was that Shell and I went to a conference in Toronto and it was an education and performance and all of this wonderful stuff. We got to see people doing all sorts of creative things with theater. We were the only one doing film production, making films, the only one. I don't think we realized how unique we were because we just got on with it, we just did it. I've been in the role here for four years, and so over the last four years, I've had the pleasure of working with Shelly and partnering with PSTV, and you all offer such an extraordinary and, and highly sought after experience for our IT apprentices because this is a television station, so this is fantastic for our apprentices are interested in film and television, video and music production, gaming, graphic design. It's an amazing partnership that um, offers our apprentices that sort, that industry um, specific experience um, outside of what most of our, 99% of our apprentices are at schools doing tech support, you know, repairing Chromebooks and updating Sys inventory. So again, this is a highly sought after, very premier partnership that leads to opportunities beyond the apprenticeship. So for instance, we have Julian Jefferson, who's a success story, and Judy Ty that are success stories. Um, they've gone on to complete the apprenticeship and now secure roles here at the district one at PSTV and one at another office here in the district. So it's, it's amazing. And also um, the exposure that they get to be working here at 440, right? So you're working at the school district headquarters. And so you're interfacing with, you know, uh, folks from all sorts of offices and being able to build your network in that way. 
And then they get the opportunity to work the board meetings where you're now in the room with the superintendent and the members of the board. So it's, it's great exposure, great experience, like none other.